Hello everyone, welcome back to Video Pop Vloggers channel. In today's video, we'll show you how to create an infinite zoom effect using AI in Video Pop Vlogger. If you're interested in this one, keep watching the video. In this tutorial, we will be using the AI tool Midjourney one of the most widely used AI drawing software. First, open your browser and go to Midjourney's official website. Click on Join the Beta, and it will redirect you to Discord. Follow the official guide to deploy the Midjourney bot. And then you can start drawing. Enter a slash and imagine to initiate a drawing command and typing some keywords you want. For example, man on foot in the woods. Full body. Super detail. At the end, add two dashes, followed by AR 16 to line to set the AI output to landscape aspect ratio. After short wait, you will see the image generated by Midjourney. Choose a satisfactory piece or click the button to redraw if needed. After that, the system will pop up dialog box. We can modify the keywords or directly click Submit. Then, choose a desired image and click on the corresponding number below. The system will automatically ignore your image and you will see options like zoom out two times. Click on zoom out two times to have AI redraw a smaller version. And then it will redraw the scene after zooming out. Once again, choose an image you find satisfactory and enlarge it. This time, I click on custom zoom and the system will pop a dialog box. Enter some keywords in it. Then, generate the image again. Repeat this process until you get a series of image. Now, open Vidipop Vlogger and import all the image into the media library. The system will automatically create a folder. Double click to open and view all the image. Click on video product in the top left corner to expand the menu. Find the setting. Or use the shortcut key F2 to open the setting menu. Click on Timeline and find Photo Duration. Change your time to 1 second, then return to the main interface. Arrange your photos in the video track in order from distant to close. Select the leftmost material. Click on Motion Editor. Add a keyframe at the beginning and the end of the timeline. Adjust the box to fit the screen for the first keyframe. Next, drag the playhead to the right on the timeline. Then add a second keyframe. At this point, we need to make the box exactly double in size. Here is a little trick. Precisely, place the top right corner of the box at the center of the middle circle, like this. Then, drag the box to the center and click Apply to return to the main interface. Repeat this process for the following image except for the last one. For smoother transition, click on Transitions, find Fade, and add it to the transition points between images. That's it! An infinite zooming effect video is now complete. If you want to know more about other tricks or what has been going on with Video Pop Vlogger, be sure to click that subscribe button to your subscribe channel if you haven't yet. And we will see you soon in our next video. Hope you enjoy. Bye bye.